My name is Valentin Greutert. I am uh, the head developer of a new production software called APMS. Uh, I am also a film producer um, based in Zurich, Switzerland. And so why, why a new production software? That was, uh, let's look at the starting point of this project. And it, actually, it's, it's pretty straightforward and simple. There is a huge lack of good software for film production. I, I'm a film producer myself, and um, I find it amazing that for post-production we have always the newest and best software regarding effects, grading, or whatever. But on a financial level, to handle our productions, we are virtually uh, uh, in the black. So, I mean, you are probably all, some of you know the movie magic budgeting, that's pretty much the only software that is really made for, for, for film production, but it only does budgeting, it doesn't do anything else. And uh, I know a lot of producers are all around Europe and most of them are really working with Excel. And Excel is a nice software, but it wasn't made for film production and it doesn't have the features that we need to be in control of uh, our uh, films. So this causes very high risk and inefficiency. And uh, in the meantime, we have technical progress that allows for so much better software. I mean, 10 years ago and now, it's just a, a whole different world. And uh, we have a focus on international collaboration. I mean, most of our productions, they are uh, international co-productions. And that makes it very complicated sometimes if you have one, two, three, four, five co-producers on a project to get all the numbers together and to handle that uh, properly. So how did we uh, develop uh, that software? Uh, I wrote, uh, I paired up with uh, people in Germany and France and we wrote a project paper and it was financed uh, by Media Pilot Projects. Thank you to Media and the Swiss Federal Office of Culture. It, it wasn't difficult to finance this uh, project because everybody uh, could easily see that um, there really is a lack of, of good software for film production. Um, I then wrote a 100-page specification uh, for this software. Uh, I talked to a lot of producers around Europe to see what they think a, a software like that should be able to do. Um, with the programmers, the software was programmed in Poland. We had to decide for a, for a programming language. Uh, this is maybe a little bit a technical aspect, but uh, it was uh, HTML5 versus Flex, and we chose Flex, and I'll tell you in a while um, why we did that. And yeah, the time frame from, from start to version one was about four years. Uh, version one has come out uh, about a month ago. And uh, yeah, what can APMS do? It is a software for controlling film production finance. It has uh, four modules, uh, that's budgeting, financing, cash flow, and cost control. It is a platform independent client server system. That means uh, platform independent, it runs on, on Windows, on Mac, on Linux. And client server means that you have the software on your computer, you actually install it on your computer, but you can exchange your data uh, through a server with uh, users that you invite to your project. Now, why was this client server system very important? When I talked to producers, um, it was a very important aspect that they have the, the, the software on their computer. You cannot have a cloud-based uh, budgeting software because uh, often when you shoot a movie, you are somewhere where you wouldn't have a, a good internet connection, so the data needs to be on your computer. And that was also why it was uh, programmed in Flex and not HTML5. Uh, let's look at the, some of the features we have and the problems we tackled. Uh, here you see the, the interface of the budgeting. Uh, it's not very, uh, it's a little bit soft here on this uh, canvas. Um, we have, for example, spending effects. A lot of funds now, uh, today, they require uh, spending effects. So you, they give you 100% of money, they require you to spend 150%. And if you have a complex financing structures, you, ha you might have four or five funds uh, requiring these spending effects. So we, we de devised uh, a mechanism to track these spending effects in your budget. Uh, we have different currencies. Almost all our productions are co-productions, or even if they're not co-productions, you take some services from abroad and you have to be able to handle various currencies in your budget. 
uh, you have uh, several producers, so you can attribute each account to a certain producer and have a better overview of uh, who needs to spend what. We have uh, um, fringes and extra costs. That's something that's super complicated in, in co-productions a lot of times because every country has their own regulations how to deal with uh, uh, fringes on wages. Uh, so we devised uh, a mechanism to control this uh, centrally. We have attachments. So to every account you can attach a, a file, be it a quote or a contract. And this will give you later the possibility to, to know why you put in that number because you have attached uh, the, 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 the quote or the contract. And we also have uh, budget schemes. Um, that means um, a lot of times certain funds require certain specific budget structures. But if you have a co-production, uh, you use one budget structure and then every co-producer has to use their own. So the, we uh, devised a mechanism that transposes your budget into another uh, scheme uh, just like that. You have to do it manually, it can't be done uh, completely uh, uh, automized, but this will help you a lot um, delivering the budget schemes that you need to, to finance your film. Let's move over to cash flow. Why is cash flow important? Cash flow is important because uh, a lot of funds, they only pay a lot uh, of money at when you deliver your final cost report. So at the very, very, very end of your production. But by that, you have spent all the money already. So interim financing is something very important. Also reporting, a lot of funds uh, nowadays, they require cash flow reports before they pay the next installment because they want to see that your production is still sound and not running on ground. And really, this is very, very difficult to control with Excel. I mean, uh, cash flow plans that were, are made in Excel are, are essentially useless. So um, I just want to show you quickly how, what kind of mechanism we de devised for that. Uh, maybe, I'm not sure if you can read it well, but um, this is the cash flow setup uh, in cost control uh, in, in APMS. And what you essentially do is you draw your whole production on a, on a, on a virtual timeline. And you have three elements to do that, milestones, phases, and processes. And later, when you uh, want to add a cash flow rule to your uh, budget, you can choose it very simply if it's milestone-based, process-based, or a date. And if your production changes during the planning, you just go back to the settings and you can move around the milestones or, or make the phases longer according to the new facts and the whole cash flow plan will move accordingly. So this is a very uh, simple uh, and precise um, mechanism to create your cash flow plans. Um, cost control, that's uh, one of the areas that is most difficult in film production because when you're in production, it's very difficult if you ask your production manager, what's the movie going to cost in the end? He has huge problems because you cannot wait for accounting. You cannot wait for invoices to tell you what your movie will cost. You have to work with, a, with estimates and actuals. You cannot just work with actuals because these numbers are come in way too late. So what we devised here, this is um, you can add cost items to your accounts. So that is, when you're in production, you can add as many cost items as you like to each of your accounts. And you can work with a mis mix of estimates and actuals. And this will provide you with a very accurate uh, cost report. You can also relay accounting schemes. So you, you, every co-producer, they can take their accountings, uh, accountants and they can relay the, the, the accounting scheme they use in their, in their company accounting and put it behind the budget of the film. And then they can import the accounting data directly into, into, your, into cost control. This uh, allows you to have accurate cost reporting and especially uh, transparency. Because also here you can attach uh, you, uh, to each cost item, you can attach your invoice or whatever is, is in the back of that. And you can have a complete representation of all costs of your uh, project uh, also to be stored uh, for later uh, um, purposes. Some more features quickly, users and synchronization. You can invite users to your project. You can define access restrictions. What are they allowed to do? What are they not allowed to do? And um, when you synchronize data uh, over the server, you can just decide what, which user is allowed to see what. You don't have to synchronize everything. For certain users, you can just synchronize something. You can also lock that so that he's not uh, uh, able to, to, to change that. 
and um, that um, allows for collaboration very easily with your co-producers. You just exchange the data over the server like that. Um, Another feature is customizable prints because every fund requires different prints, you know, so they require the spending effects of that fund, they of that fund, and, and it's very difficult with Excel to create a print that looks fine and has exactly the data and only the data that you want them to see. So what you can do in, in APMS is you, you can just uh, drag down the columns that you actually want to, to have on the print, you drag them down, you can give them a name, and when you print, uh, you have exactly the columns and a nice printout that, that um, you uh, want to have. Uh, yes, then APMS license types. I see if we had some questions. I will leave that out. You can, you can check that on the website, which is this, apms-software.com. Um, we already have about 300 users who work with this regularly. Also, Sten, who invited me uh, for this presentation, is a user of APMS. Uh, we have a lot of great feedback. I would be happy if you take a look and if you give feedback to us. That's very important. We're trying to improve the software all the time. Um, yes, that's it. Uh, maybe there's questions? I think uh, I, I, I put a lot of effort into making it very intuitive. And um, I think, I mean, there's always a problem that people who need to adopt to new software, that it, they, it, it's not something they actually love to do. But I think this software has so many features that are useful, especially also in, in European film production, where you have these co-productions and various funds and to handle all that. Um, that it's uh, really not very difficult to, to get a hold of it. <laughs>